到啦。好翻回去，有冇位置？咩啊？我多次。搞錯，佢帶住咁大把刀嘅。明白。情報話目標喺南邊過緊嚟啊。嗯，清楚。OK， 各單位準備，同我睇實佢。你捉個威聲先好啊 ！He's early. I'm not fucking blind. Relax, old boy. We're on the same side, remember? 仲有得幾串喎。喂，有冇貨 ？Yeah, you got the money? 喂，情報有變。咩啊？有個碼頭警衛，佢由後面上緊嚟啊！揾人截住佢啦！細路唔好亂嚟啊 ！Look, I can get you three, four keys a week if you want. 嗯，卡丁。喂 ，My shit's not good enough for you. 喂，兩發生咩事啊？咩啊？邊撚過嚟？停手！喂喐 ！Come, come, my friend. Are you crazy? No, don't. Maybe we can sort something out, huh? 你恐我啊？你知唔知我係邊個啊？收火機，唔好俾佢走啦！嗱，截住佢！我伤我我啊 ！Fucking hell! Don't do it, man! Don't do it! 所講嘅嘢可能會用紫銅筆記低，或者成為情報證供，明唔明白？Fifteen years to do that, you know. We're not kids anymore. Whatever, man. Ask anyone. Jackie Ma still looks good. Jackie Ma is still the same old, but it's good to see you. So what the fuck? They finally deport your ass from the United States? No, it's mutual. Time I came home anyway. Yeah, lock up, home sweet home. So what they get you on? Nothing that'll stick. Ha! <laughs> well, don't let them pin any extra shit on you. Fuckers will try. Let me tell you. I stay here. You're from Old Prosperity. Happens all the time. Hey, so you still in touch with any of the guys from there? A few, you know. People kind of go their separate ways. But you remember Winston? He's moved all the way up to Red Pole in the Sun on Ye. I've got a couple of things going with him right now. Matter of fact, huh? Red Pole in the Sun on Ye. Shit, Dog Eyes always said he'd be running that neighborhood. Oh, Dog Eyes is a Red Pole too. And still a total punk guy. He was the one who got Winston in. They were pretty tight back then, but now, hey, wasn't Dog Eyes hanging with your sister? Yeah, it was a long time ago. Hey, remember when we were kids and you stabbed Dog Eyes with a pen? You totally saved my ass that day. Oh man, I gotta tell Winston that story. You'll fucking love it, man. Way fucking Shen in the flesh. I can't believe it. Jackie Ma, looks like I'm out of here. Hey, Jackie. So look, if you and uh, Winston ever need help with any of that shit you got going on with him, of course, man. Look me up when you get out. It'll just be like old times. It seems that the evidence against you has failed to appear. How do you explain that? You must be a very dangerous man, Wei Shen.
that is exactly what we want people to think. I trust that my men weren't too rough on you, officer. You might ask them the same question, sir. Those guys are out of shape. It paid off, though. I made contact with Jackie Ma. I'm in. Good work. Use him to get close to Winston Chu. Do whatever it takes. Raymond here will be your handler. You'll report everything through him. Our intel suggests that Winston is looking for muscle. You need to find a way to make him trust you. I've done this before. Not in Hong Kong. American gangs, even Asian ones, don't compare to the triads here. The Sun on Yi is the most powerful Look, gang. Raymond. Your, your name is Raymond, right? Yes. I grew up with these guys. I know who they are, what they are. All the intel reports in the world won't give you that. We want the Red Poles, the lieutenants like Winston, all of them. And most of all, the Dragon Head. Candidly, Wei, previous attempts to get close to him haven't panned out. We don't have much to go on. That's why you're here. I'm hoping that you can bring something more to our investigation. I understand, sir. Look, the sooner I'm on the street, the sooner I can start. Raymond will be in touch. Owen oh, Way. Good luck out there. Respectfully, sir, are you sure about him? He'll be under extreme stress maybe for a very long time. Now, I'm not sure he has the discipline to hold up. According to the file, he has a history of, of extreme behavior. Yes, and an astonishing number of convictions. He obviously blames the Trias for what happened to his family. It could turn into a vendetta. Raymond, Wei Shen is perfect for this job. <laughs> man, this is going to be great. Yeah, thanks again, Jackie. I appreciate the intro. No problem, man. By the way, you know I tried looking you up a few years back, but I couldn't find shit. Do they have internet in America? <laughs> I think they're getting it next year. I guess you were in prison or something. Come on, let's get out of here. Hey, Jill May, how are you, baby? Jackie, you know my parents don't want you to talk to me. Your parents don't even know me. Once we get to know each other, they'll love me. Leave him alone! I'm going to call the cops! Huh? You don't talk to me like that! Stop it! Get off him! I don't care who you are! Let go of Jackie! No, I'm going to no. fuck you up! Uh, 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 Kidding me? <laughs> yeah, all right. Come the fuck on. That looked nasty. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Bunch of fucking assholes. So everything's cool? Well, you're welcome anyway. Come on, Jackie. Let's go see Winston. Here we are. Winston's mom owns the restaurant. Oh! Where the fuck do you think you're going? Relax, man. This is Wei. Wei Shen. I told you about him, remember? Fuck. We can't keep track of your bullshit friends, Jackie. No outsider. He's not an outsider. He's from old prosperity. Like us. Ho Chi all day, Jama. Wei is old school, you know? I grew up with the guy. Whole prosperity, huh? Ain't I gonna get you down there again? I've been on vacation. Young Jackie said you were looking for people. Oh, Jackie, fuck, eh? No, 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 no. You should have seen it, Winston. We just beat up like 10 of Dog Eyes guys in the market by himself. Oh. Hi, man. Well, they attacked us. Seems to me you could use some better help. We come on, yeah, huh? Winston? I don't like this cocky little fucker. Oh, wait, 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 wait a minute. <laughs> Dang Yudson, I do remember you. You had a, a sister, right, Hamaya? Yeah, Mimi. Mimi, Mimi Shen. I remember her. Hung out with dog eyes. <laughs> no offense. Dang I so to Where is she now? She's dead. Ah. Sorry. Mo oh, Yisia. So, ten guys, huh? 
You fearless? I'm just crazy. Try capable. Uh -huh. We'll see. Conroy, you know that problem we got in the market? Why don't you take Way with you? Hey, Jackie, hang back a second. I want to hear more about your friend. <laughs> All right. You want to be a tough guy? Let's see if you can handle yourself. Dude, see what he's got. Great. That's all I fucking need. Hey! Hey, you got what I need? Boss, we were just leaving. Got it, huh? And it was just getting interesting, too. Winston, my old friend. So good to see you. How's your family, huh? What do you want, dog eyes? Oh, Winston, wait, wait, wait. Brother, I just came to talk to you, man. For old time's sake. Let's work something out here, okay? We can share the night market, huh? We're both Song Ong Yi, both grown men. We shouldn't be fighting like children. <laughs> hey, who's the new blood? It's Wei. You remember Mimi Shen? Back when you first started getting girls with Big Smiley. Oh, Mimi. Oh, yeah. First girl ever sucked my cock. <laughs> yeah, so what? Way's her brother. And I was the first guy who ever stabbed you. You remember me now? Whoa, 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 Way. What the fuck, man? Seriously, Way. I apologize. I'm really sorry. Your sister blew me. <laughs> the night market is mine, dog eyes. You got Siwa in the warehouse. That was the deal. So stay the fuck out. Hey, tell your sister to give me a call, huh? I wouldn't mind giving her a mouthful. <laughs> he hasn't changed. Yeah, he has. He used to be my friend. Jackie, you two go to the night market. You make sure people understand that I'm in control, not dog eyes. Got it? Got it, boss. Moment I. And you fuck up anybody who tries to get in your way. I want to send a fucking message. Oh, that was awesome, man. All this teen, teen, teen. It's like you were born to do this. Hey, Jackie. You want to tell her what's going on? Just keeping an eye on things. Yeah? What'd you see? I tell you what I didn't see. Nothing to be impressed about. I'm watching you, new guy. You fuck up? What? We're gonna throw down? What kind of grade school shit is this, huh? I work my ass off all day, so fuck off and grow up. Jackie! You're coming with me. We got something to take care of. And you! Don't fuck with me. You shitting me? So what'd you do? Nothing, nothing. Say mut the mole. I came straight to you. Didn't want to start anything major, but without you knowing, you know? So get this. A couple years ago, this guy Ming came to me and asked me to look out for him while he did business. Special K mostly, but other stuff too. I thought, why not? I'd take a nice little cut for my boys, no problem. But this week, I send Jackie here to pick up the envelope, and he tells my boy to fuck off. Apparently, he's friends with Dog Eyes now, so we can all go fuck ourselves. You want me to make an example out of Dog Eyes? That home Garton is gonna get what's coming in. Right now, I need someone to take care of me. You make it up for me tonight, and we got a deal. Huh? I got a message oh, shit. for you. Stop! Dog eyes gonna kill you. Fuck dog eyes. <laughs> Winston owns this area. You fuck with us and you'll regret it. Okay, okay. But please, make sure dog eyes doesn't kill me. Oh. Oh. Fuck. Wei Sheng, I'm Inspector Tang. You have quite a rap sheet here. 
multiple arrests in San Francisco, alleged ties to organized crime, and now you're here enforcing for the sun on Yi. You know, you don't have to throw your life away like this. <laughs> your concern's really moving. You know, I appreciate that. I'm suddenly realizing I should have never dropped out of art school. You know, I could have made it. I could have been a real somebody. Thank you for showing me the light, officer. I want to give you a chance, Shen, but you have to work with me. Then maybe I can cut you a deal. Oh, Superintendent, I'm in the middle of an interrogation. Inspector, there's been a misunderstanding. A misunderstanding, sir? As your superior officer, I'm instructing you to release this man. But, sir, I have it on record that he's son on ye. I understand that. I can't simply just cut him loose. I mean, you're asking me to release a criminal with known connections to the triad. And not only is it against well, for protocol... for God's sake, Tang, he's one of us. What? Jesus, Pendrew, let me get the door. There are few badges outside who didn't hear you. It's all right, Wei. We can trust her. Trust her? I just met her. Congratulations, Tang. So now you know. Maybe now we can make sure that we're helping Wei, not making his job harder than it already is, hmm? Yeah, it doesn't seem like I have much of a choice. No. No, you don't. Now see yourself out. Permission to speak freely. Denied. You need to be more careful, Wei. Much more careful. I can't bail you out like this again. Sir, I don't want to hear it. Just be careful. American gangs and Asian ones don't compare to the clients. I don't like this cock and little fucker. You need to be more careful, Way. Much more careful. Way. You okay, man? You look like someone took a shit on your face. <laughs> Jackie, I'm, you know, I'm just a little frustrated, stuck being Winston's errand boy. You know, I was making serious bank back in the States. Come on, we're just paying our dues. Winston's a loyal guy. He'll hook us up when the time's right. You can't always wait for the world to hand you what you want. Sometimes you got to just take it. Totally, man. It's time to take a little initiative. We got to prove ourselves to Winston and the Sun on Yi, or we'll never move up. Is there anything? going down in the next few days. Shit, yeah, there is. Dog Eyes has a big shipment of stolen goods coming in. Well, that's good for Dog Eyes, but that might be too much or too fast. The last thing I need right now is taking a sticky red pole up my ass. It's not like that. It's a small deal. Word is there's only a few low-level lun you're looking after it. If we boost that shit and give Winston a nice fat cut, he's going to be mad impressed. No way he doesn't promote us after that. You'd have to be certain it couldn't be traced back to Winston. Or us. Sure, of course. They're never gonna know it was us. Unless we get caught. Well, we won't unless you fuck it up. Come on, get in. Time to move up in the world. <laughs> guy we're meeting. Don't worry. I'll take you from here. You sure you don't want me to stick around? No, man. I got it under control. So no uh... All right. Your deal. Hey, wait. You did good out there. Here. Take this watch. You earned it. Great. I finally hit the big time. I got this my man, Wei! He done good. He restored order to the night market. Well, he took a chance on me, Winston. I wanted to make sure it paid off. You got the right attitude. It's gonna pay off for you. You'll see. You know anything about the minibus racket? Well, same as everyone. If you want to drive a good route, you pay the toll. That's right. You know the pickup on Marble Drive? The most profitable route in the whole fucking city. From now on, it's yours. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate it, Winston. <laughs> Dog eyes, won't. Well, right now it's his route. But you know how to deal with it, huh? It'll be my fucking pleasure. I gotta take this. Take a few of the guys with you to back you up. Let's go. What are you doing here? I'm sure you and Pendrew have a lot of top-secret backdoor business to attend to. Look, I'm sorry about how I acted in there. You know, just playing the part. 
I'm already out there on the streets. I hear things like this ketamine racket. I'll see what I can dig up. How's that for an olive branch? Serious? Just like that? Look, I'll help where I can. <laughs> what? I'm just a little shocked. I'm just used to Pendra's people being more like him. I just think we'd be better off helping each other. Come on, what do you say? I could really use the help if you're willing to give it. Well, all right. Excuse me, do you speak English? I like to think so. Well, enough to get by anyways. You? Yeah, I... Wait, what do you mean? Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I speak English. I kind of guessed. What can I do for you? I'm looking for this place, Old Temple Academy. I thought it was around here. It's supposed to be a kung fu school, but I'm totally lost. <laughs> I have no sense of direction. Yeah, I, I think I know where it is. I mean, it's not too far. I, I can give you a ride. I mean, it'll be easier than explaining where it is. Uh, okay, yeah, that, that'd be really great. My name's Amanda, by the way, or Amy. Either one is fine. Oh, nice to meet you, Amy. I'm wet. Can I help you? Yeah, I'd like to sign up for some kung fu classes. I read about your school in my guidebook. Ah, uh, your guidebook. Yeah, it said you teach a style with a long lineage, but in spite of all that, it's still considered very effective. You want to take classes, okay. And you, did you also read about this place in some book? Well, I... Uh... Wait. I know you. Yes, Sifu Kwok. I used to be your student. I'm Wei, Wei Shen. Ah, yes. The one who went to America. So you brought this girl back with you. Uh, your skill level with girls, very good. Now time to assess your skill level in Kung Fu. Try to steer them in the right direction, especially the younger ones. But they all want to be Song Ong Yi. Now, now I just train them in the ways of my art. Try to teach them compassion and discretion, and pray for the best. See, if I don't think there's much more you can do. Oh, Jade Rat. The Song Dynasty, right? Very good. The Song Dynasty? That's like a thousand years old or something. That's real? Part of a set of twelve. One for each animal of the Chinese calendar. The Sifu? You used to have the whole set. What happened to the others? Stolen. By a former student. Corrupted by the triads. I'm so sorry to hear that, Sifu. So was I. <laughs> this collection meant a lot to me. Sometimes you just have to let things go. I should close up. It was good to see you again, Wei. And your lovely fiance. What? <laughs> okay, uh, that was fun. What do you want to do now? Uh, I need to get home, but uh, I will definitely call you later. Wait, get over here now. What's going on, Winston? It's Benny, manager of Club Bam Bam, old friend of mine. Now he's working for Dog Eyes. That Ham Gatan is getting back at us for taking his minibus route. Look, I'll go talk to Benny, make him see reason. Yeah. Yeah, wait, you go do that. <laughs> Who the fuck are you? I'm looking for Benny. Hey, Benny! Yeah? Some guy here wants to talk to you. Hey, hey, what can I do for you? I have a message from an old friend, Winston Chu. What, 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 Winston? Well, that, uh, this isn't such a good idea. I think you should leave. He wants you to know that Dog Eyes isn't your problem anymore. If he gives you any trouble, you let Winston know, and I'll take care of it, personally. You heard that, man. 
Get the fuck out of here. Benny, get the fuck out of here. Benny, I know you're in there. <laughs> Relax, Benny. I'm not gonna kill you. Okay. Just listen. Okay. What do you want? Just what I said. Winston wants to be your friend. And what about Dark Eyes? Not your problem. I hope you're right. For my sake. Can I go now? Of course you can, Benny. You're late. Conroy's still watching. He's got a real hard on. Is your cover compromised? Well, you haven't fished me out of the harbor yet. All right. How are you doing? How am I doing? <laughs> Fuck, Raymond. Where do I start? There's a civil war brewing in the sun on Yi. Winston and Dog Eyes escalated practically every day. Don't you read my fucking reports? I mean, you personally. How are you doing? <laughs> Look, Raymond. I gotta get back. Your state of mind is important. It's important to me, it's important to how you do your job. Fuck you! I do my job just fine! Well, that's for me to decide! You mean Pendrew! Pendrew assigned me as your controller. And listen, Wei, Pendrew may not be concerned about you, but I am. I know you have a personal stake here, but this cannot be a vendetta. We're cops. There are rules. You're a cop. I'm an undercover cop. The rules are different. And you're fucking concerned about me? You are an officer of the law, Wei. Same as me. We are not the same. You understand? We done? Yeah, we're done. Thanks, man. It's fucking great when you're on my side. <laughs> Wait, we've been waiting for you. You guys smell something? I do. Get your sexy glow shoe. You know what happens to rats, Way? Uh, yeah, I, I heard. Conroy gave me all the details when he was helping me out on that minute. You're so sad! Who the fuck do you think you are, huh? You come in out of nowhere and suddenly our guys start to get arrested? He ran it out, pop star Winston. I know he did! What are you gonna do to him? This motherfucker right here is a snitch! Is that right, Ming? You fucking rat. I sent you to pop star, but now he's in jail! Yeah? And who stands to gain the most from that? You're gonna take over Pop Star's whole ketamine racket now. No more scraps for you. You'll supply the whole city with drugs. You and Dog Eyes. Pop Star's gone, but you're still dealing, aren't you? So who's supplying you? Are you guys actually listening to this asshole? He's a rat. He's a fucking rat! Take him to Hong Kong, young lap stop! You're still working for that bastard, aren't you? I'm a Wait, listen, I swear! Oh, it's a dirty fucker, man! Don't my my You get in this business for yourself, you're bound to end up like little Lanta. Can I help you with something? Yeah. Are you Ping? <laughs> no. There's no Ping. How about the owner, then? I'm the owner. I'm just not Ping. <laughs> All right. Not Ping. I'm picking up hardware for Orange Lotus. You know it? Orange Lotus? Sure. This is some pretty sophisticated stuff. Sure you can handle it? I'll manage. My number's on the package. You need a hand getting slot X into socket Y? Give me a call. Inspector. Away. I'm glad you're here. What do you know about the underground racing circuit? Well, they drive fast. Occasionally they crash into something. Yeah, and occasionally they end up killing each other. Hmm. Well, that's manslaughter at best. But these last couple of files don't feel like manslaughter to me. It's got more of a deliberate feel to it. You want me to check it out? Yeah. Get into the circuit and see what you can find out. All right. See you.
good win. Lucky for you, those Amaz kept getting in the way. One in a million shot. You want a rematch? Yeah, sure. I'll take you. <laughs> if you're ready for the big time, let me know. Everybody knows I'm the best driver in the city. Everyone. Oh, yeah? I'll take you down too, hotshot. Just as soon as my car is fixed. You okay? No, I'm in big trouble. I really need your help, please. What's wrong? It's... It's this... A gun? Yes. Charlie made me carry it in my purse for him. He didn't want the cops to find it, so he made me take it. And now he's gone, and I don't know what to do with it. Charlie, he's one of Dog Eye's people, right? Yes, and you took over, right? So in a way, the gun is yours, too. You'll take it, won't you? Sure, I'll take it. That's it? That's, uh, that's your big problem. Yes, thank you so much, Wei. I knew I was right to trust you. Don't worry, Tiffany, I'll take care of it. Thanks, Wei. You're the greatest. Andrew? What are you doing here? Where's Raymond? This is something I wanted to handle personally, Wei. Do you have Charlie Fang's gun? Yeah. I'm sure you've noticed the guns are something of a rarity in Hong Kong. Not like in the States. This particular gun is quite important. So who's the dead guy? I was hoping you'd help me with that, actually. Officer Shen, take up a firing position. Your weapon, officer. Good firing, Wei. Andrew! What are you doing? I told you he wasn't important. Now he is. He's going to help us nail Charlie Pang. It's for the greater good, Wei. You understand? I don't think I do, sir. Wei, I know who you are. You're just like me. You do what must be done. Hmm. Local PD is on their way. You should go. What the fuck's going on? Dog I shut up Winston's mother's restaurant tonight. Winston, I just heard. Your mother? She's, she's fine. But two of our people were killed. And a couple customers were wounded. The police are there now. Wait, wait. He went after your family? Hello? Everyone's outside. What did you say? Always fine. Listen up! We're hitting a switch up on the waterfront. All his trucks boots to that place. It's how he makes his money. I want it burned to the ground. See who runs the operation. Put that hump guard's heart in the shadow grave. Hey, don't turn my gear. It's over. Winston, are you sure about this? Of course, I'm fucking sure. Look, what's the chairman gonna say when he finds his warehouse floating in the ocean? He's just not gonna like it. But there's no way Dog Guys walks away from this. So burn the warehouse, but take Suha alive. Put him to work for you, and give the chairman a bigger cut than he was getting from Dog Eyes. Okay. Okay, okay, do it. Bring him alive. Right, boss. <laughs> Shit. Fuck. Suha, you're coming with me. Fuck you! You're not taking me alive! Stop! Yeah. I said, don't move! Fucking cops. Let go of me! Ah! Fuck! That was fucking crazy! Trying to insult me? That car's crap! Let me fix my car up.
Then I'll take you. Easy. Fine. It's your funeral. This guy wants in? He's gonna have to show me some blood on his hands. I'll show you true colors tonight, brother. You are an officer of the law. Me, but who's he talking to? It's the Dai Lo, man. It's the chairman. Wait, you're coming with me. Looks like you're gonna meet Uncle Po. The rest of you, wait here. Don't do anything until you hear from me. What's going on? You are staying here like I told you. And you are shutting the fuck up! Got it? Yeah, boss. Of course. Good. Let's go. Who gives a shit? Fuck off, John. Hey, Winston. What's wrong? You look a little pale, man. That dog guy tells me you've been throwing your weight around. What happened? You guys used to be tight as shit. Is he here? Nah, he left a while ago. Without a scratch. Doesn't bode so well for the other parties involved. <laughs> Go right in. Have fun. Uncle Poe. Ah, Winston. Come in. Sit down. Have some tea. And you, young man, must be way. Winston speaks very highly of you. Winston has been a good friend to me. I've tried to do right by him. I like the way you think. That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion. Used to be more common. Winston says you're the one who made sure Siwa was not arrested. No, it was Winston's idea. He had to assert himself, assert his position, but he didn't want to inconvenience you in the process. Did he now? In any case, you did well. I want to show you my gratitude. Uncle Pope, there's really no need. Don't argue with me. Do you know Roland Ho? He has a business collecting debts. The other day, he told me that he could use some help. It's uh, quite lucrative, you know. <laughs> Tell him I sent you. Winston won't mind in the slightest. Will you? Thank you, Uncle. Winston, 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 relax. I know you were provoked. God damn it. I bet a thousand bucks I was going to be carrying you out in a fucking body bag. Uncle Poe must like you. Uh, yeah, I don't think he has an opinion on me either way. All right. Well, I tell you what, you get tired of spinning your wheels in the night market, give me a call. There's more to this business than strong army street vendors. Ricky. Your name's Ricky, right? I appreciate the offer. You know, let me think about it and I'll get back to you. Hey, rolling hoe? Who's asking? My name's Wei Shen. Ah, Wei. You got friends in high places, my boy. I hear you and Winston have been making trouble with Dog Eyes. Dog Eyes has been asking for trouble. <laughs> I remember when I was like you. Always looking for a fight. Ready to kill anyone who so much as looked at me sideways. Here's a tip for you, kid. Don't take on a boss in your own triad. Unless you know for a fact someone else is gonna back you up. Hierarchy is the only thing anyone cares about. Always have, always will. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, old timer. So, uh, when can we get to work? Okay, big man. Petsy Wing. Bad luck at Mahjong. You'll need this. 
collect what she owes. Raymond. Shed. Finally. Where the hell have you been? Look, I, uh... Do you have any idea what's going on? What happened at the warehouse? Raymond, do you ever actually read my reports? Your reports? All I have to do is read the goddamn newspapers. They're calling it a massacre. If it ever came out that the police were involved, we're dead. It won't. Well, you can't know that. You at least, you at least could have turned Siwa over to us. It would have helped our case. And would have put the entire operation at risk. What does Penju say? You know, he's not your handle, Wade. I am. Well, then fucking handle it, Raymond. Well, how'd you think this was gonna go down? Huh? Whatever it takes. You remember that? You wanted results, and you can't get them sitting behind a desk, nose in a rule book, with a stick up your ass. Look, Raymond, I am doing what needs to be done. No, no, you've crossed the line, Wade. I'm gonna terminate this operation. You can't do that. Pendrew won't allow it. Pendrew may like to take chances. I don't. And you are dangerous. Fine. But before you go back to your office to try and pull the plug, go ahead and tell Pendrew that I just met the chairman of the Sun on Yi. The chairman? <laughs> Wait, you're, you're just a foot soldier. Well, this foot soldier has just been marked for promotion because I made sure Suwa got out safely. It'll be in my report. And maybe this time you'll actually read it. Yeah, he mentioned it the other day. Congratulations. <laughs> no problem at all, Mrs. Chu. Hello, Wei. Thanks for driving me around. Yeah, no problem. So, where are we going? The flower shop. I still have to pick the color I want. You won't believe how much work it is to get ready for a wedding. We've been planning for eight months now, and there's still so much to be done. I'm sure it'll be fine. Oh, it better be perfect. My wedding has to be perfect. Ah, oh, so good to see you again. Welcome, welcome. I'm here to finalize the details of the flower arrangement. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm just the driver. I'm just gonna change back and then we'll be done. Uh, actually, there is one other thing. Black orchids. This probably sounds silly, but it was my mother's favorite flower, and now that she's gone, I was thinking that I'd love to have a black orchid centerpiece. I'm afraid that's impossible. <laughs> there are none to be found in Hong Kong. Really? Well, I thought they had some down at the Garden Temple. Well, yes, but they're not for sale. The other day, the CEO of Old Boy Trading wanted one for his daughter. He told them they offered Temple $100,000. They still say no. <laughs> it's incredible, no? <laughs> a black orchid at a wedding guarantees that the couple stays together for the rest of their lives. Oh, well, Wei, come on. We can go now. Thanks for being so helpful, Way. I really appreciate it. Of course. It. Sometimes this wedding thing stresses me out. There's so much to get right, and you only get one try. Don't worry, Peggy. It's gonna be perfect. Oh, it's so nice to find someone you can really rely on. I can see why Winston likes you. I'm so happy you can make it. 
Congratulations. Peggy, you look stunning. <laughs> Thanks, Wade. <laughs> you both must be very happy. Yes. The best day of your life, so they say. You know what? They're right. <laughs> <laughs> if you say so. Oh, Uncle Paul, Dude, welcome. Congratulations. My guest of honor. I'm happy to be here. It's nice to see someone who wants to be a good family man. Not enough of that nowadays. Hi. You look absolutely lovely, my dear. <laughs> Thank you. Almost as lovely as your mother in law. <laughs> oh, and this is Chu. I expect the food to be. Wait, wait. Test. I got a case of the chairman's favorite wine in my car. I forgot to bring it in. Do you mind grabbing in and making sure they know it's for him? I'm gonna make sure he gets inside, okay? Yeah, sure thing, Winston. You gotta enjoy your day, okay? Where you parked? Ah, right through there. I'm going, I'm going. Just bring it into the kitchen. I need them here, now! Uncle Paul! Are you okay? Can you walk? What's going on? What happened to Winston? Okay, come on. We gotta get you out of here. My uncle, he's hurt. We need a doctor, now! What is this? What's going on here? My boy, maybe you'll want to leave. Before our friends, the police, show up. <laughs> Are you gonna take care of my uncle? And if anything happens to him, I'm holding Hello, you police? personally responsible. Oh, thank God. Are we clear? Okay, okay. Where have you been? Stuck in traffic. It's Hong Kong. Fuck with. You think showing up for these things is easy for me? I know you've been through a lot, boy. More than we have any right to ask. Now the wedding. It was a massacre, Raymond. A massacre. Winston was a red pole, sure. But his wife? They fucking gunned down his wife on her wedding day. We knew you would become personally attached, Way. It's inevitable in an operation like this. And seeing something like that would be hard. Hard for anyone. It's war now. No, it's not. You're a cop, all right? Your job is to enforce the law. You can't remember that? I'll pull you out right now. Pull me out? Your job was to get close to Winston. Now, that's not much of a strategy anymore. Get close to? Open your eyes, Raymond. I am Winston now. With him gone, I'll be taking his place. You want the chairman? I report to him now. You want the Red Poles? I'm one of them. That's what worries me, Wayne. You're one of them. You want to give up the best undercover HKPD has ever had? Your best shot taking down the sun on Yi? Exactly. We done? Yeah, we're done. Anything happens to me, you look after that people, okay? Get Peggy out of here. Winston! She doesn't. Mrs. Chu. I was just stopping by to see if there was anything you needed. I, I know it's no consolation, 
But I gotta look at one of the gunmen from the wedding. Now I will find him. And I'll make him tell me who's responsible. Baby, I promise. Are you insane? Think of all the money we'll make. This is our future, you and me. Fuck you, asshole. I'm not taking off my clothes for you or anyone else. Johnny the rat face. Meet Mrs. Chu. Winston's mother. Osama! I don't know what this guy told you. Fuck! I don't know what you're talking about, you crazy old bitch. Please! Wait, wait, don't leave me here. She's fucking crazy. Okay, okay. I'll tell you anything you want to know. Just please, don't! <laughs> <laughs> Shut about the fuck this, up, man. Jackie. We gotta think. You gotta think. Don't Shut up, both of you. Winston's gone. Right now, we gotta stick together. We just can't let the 18K get away with this. What makes you so sure it was 18K? We all saw them. They were definitely 18K. Even stupid Jackie knows that. You ever think maybe they were just trying to look like 18K? Look, we've had a few skirmishes with them lately, but nothing major. It doesn't make sense that they would do something oh, this big. Oh, so, so, so who do you think it was? I don't know, but I'm gonna find out. <clears throat> and who the fuck are you? I'm here for Mr. Lee. I take it you've heard of Big Smile Lee. He's another son on ye boss, Red Bull, just like Winston. Okay, what can we do for Mr. Lee? He has decided that for the time being, you may continue your operations in this area. But the percentage previously paid to Winston We'll now go to Mr. Lee. That's an interesting proposition. But I have a counteroffer from Mr. Lee. I'd appreciate if you relay this back to him word for word. Can you do that? You tell Mr. Lee that his people stay the fuck out of our territory, and in return, we'll let him live. I don't think he'll find that offer to his liking. I think you'll find that I don't give a fuck. You see our guest out, make sure he doesn't get lost. You'll regret this. I promise you that. Tell your boss, stay the fuck out of my territory. Fuck you, eh? This isn't the end of this. So why'd you bring me out here? I have heard a lot about you, Wei Shen. <laughs> I will get to the point. You must realize that you cannot stand against Big Smile Lee alone. That's what everyone tells me. Roland Ho said I'd need other bosses to support me. Indeed. Nah, I believe in harmony, balance, peace, and I don't mind spilling a little blood to achieve it. With Uncle Po in the hospital, there's much uncertainty in the Sun on Yi. If he recovers, we will both be stable and strong. But if he dies? The 18K presents a very real threat. 
We cannot afford to appear weak. We will need to elect a new chairman quickly. <laughs> you, for instance. Ah, Big Smile Lee represents a step backwards for the Sun On Yi. Why continue to force girls into prostitution and pornography when there are other, less archaic, more profitable ways for us to make money? I have very different ideas about our future. I want to take the Sun On Yi forward. But it would be unwise even for me to stand against Big Smile Lee unaided. Which brings me to you. Nah, we both appear to have the same problem, Wei Shen. And the opportunity to benefit, if we work together. So it seems. I have my own reasons for hating Big Smile Lee's operation. Now if you stand against him, you can count on me. Good. We will talk soon. Hey, man. Wait! You won't believe what those assholes did! Who? Those guys are top glamour. They're fucking with me. I brought them another load of watches. They were supposed to give me 200,000 for them. Instead, they give me this hunk of shit. I don't even know how to ride this thing. I had to push it here. Calm down. Give me the bike. I'll get you your money. What are you gonna do? Same thing I always do, Jackie. Nah, it's not this fucking guy. What do you want? My friend Jackie tells me you owe him some money. You're sitting on it. And where'd you get off strong-arming me, huh? I know you're a cop. And I know you're a snitch. You want to see who your boys kill first? Fuck you. Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> It, asshole. <laughs> Come on, fuckers! Go on, hey! Did we stop? Let me out of here! I fucking shit myself! Fucker! Hey, let me out of here, you fucker! My people are gonna cut you into, into pieces, you hear me? Hey, you hear me, you fucker! Shut up. <laughs> Here's your guy. Hope you still want him. But I don't want this coming back to bite me in the ass. I'll take care of it. Where he's going, he won't be in a position to tell anyone. <coughs> hey, I can hear you! <coughs> what the fuck are you doing out there? Open the fucking truck, will you? <coughs> hey, show the lady some respect. <coughs> Mrs. Chu? Sammy, she's a kid. She's every day in this house eating food. She's sitting there, eating food. Sammy? Dog eyes. Dog eyes did it. Is that what Johnny told you? Winston. Some bad things, Sammy. What did you call me? Huh? Nobody call me that anymore. This is about me balling your fucking sister, isn't it? Huh? You gotta be fucking kidding me, man. Wake up, little brother. It's not like I put that needle in her arm. You can't take this stuff personally, Way. It was business. You know what I'm saying? Not to me, it wasn't. Look, if you don't like it, you take it up with Big Smiley. He's the one who needs the pussy. I was doing my job. Oh, fuck, man. Is this what this is all about? Yeah. And Winston. And Peggy. Oh, fuck! You're coming with me. Uh, look, maybe we can cut a deal. All right, stop all this shit, man. And I'll make sure that Big Smiley cuts you in on one of the side business. 
Maybe the fucking whole damn thing. I mean, hey, we can be generous, okay? Yeah, he's gonna be the future chairman of the fucking Soul on Yi. Yeah? You and Big Smile Lee are pretty close, huh? Yeah, we're tight like motherfucking brothers. Me and Winston, we were tight too. <laughs> <laughs> What what the fuck you doing, huh? Wait, 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 wait! Sit down and shut the fuck up. Jesus, I haven't been here in fucking years. Sammy, oh, cool, Mrs. Chu. I already ate. Hey, what the fuck are you doing? I'm not fucking hungry! Sammy, they it's nothing personal, just business. Oh, oh God! I'm sorry, please! No, no, no! Tradition calls for us to select a temporary chairman. Until you are well, uncle. A man who would continue as you would wish. If they were brazen enough to attack a wedding, we have to assume 18K will be coming after us. I know that you are right. Wait, my boy. Uncle, you're okay. Thanks to you. Sister Chang told me about the troubles between you and Big Smile Lee here. You must stop this fight at once. We must be united against our true enemies. Yes, of course, Uncle Po. Good. Park Mark, see to it that way is formally initiated. He's been a loyal foot soldier to the Sun Han Yi. It's time to make him a red paw. Your initiation is young Leon. He has been selling to schoolgirls and was ordered to stop. He switched to the 18K instead. Make an example of him. Thank you. I will. If any of your people have not been properly initiated, bring them with you. Uncle, we still need to decide who will lead us. What about you, Park Mark? You are my greatest friend. You know my wishes better than anyone. Would you not take my place? No, Uncle. I, I am your advisor. I cannot lead in your place. So, if not you, who then? <clears throat> Chu Chin Sao. He is your true nephew, your blood, Legacy Doyan. Who better to preserve your wishes and keep the family together? Hmm. Chu Chen, can you handle this responsibility? Temporary chairman? Yes, Uncle. I am ready and grateful for the opportunity. Park Mark, see that it is done. <laughs> Jackie, you're gonna love this. What's going on, Wei? Well, you're about to become a full member of the Sun On Yi. <laughs> Fuck me! Are you sure? 100%. Yeah, baby! <laughs> Yeah! Oh, don't worry about it, my man. It'll be your turn soon. Jackie, they're making me a red pole. What? Holy shit, way! Holy fucking shit! Jackie, let's go! Come on! Let's move! Is it done? It's 
It's done. Good, good. Brothers, from today forward, your lives will be forever changed. Because today you are my brothers. We're bound to each other by blood, sworn to protect each other to the death if necessary. With our brotherhood comes duty. You will obey our leader in all things, and you will show your brothers respect always. With our brotherhood comes power. The sun on ye does not die. The sun on ye does not forget. It rewards its sons with wealth, status, and honor. It protects their businesses and their families. It cares for their children as if they were their own. Our brotherhood pays our enemies with pain, suffering, and death. And none suffers more than a traitor. Betray your brothers, and you will die a thousand times over, slowly, in the dark. The sun on ye and the gods themselves will burn your soul from your body and crush the ashes with our heels. There are 32 oaths. With them, you are bound together. With them, you become Sun on Yi. Are you ready to begin? I read your report. I'm flattered. Was it a slow day or something? Pendra's very impressed. I'm not gonna lie, I'm sort of impressed too. He wants you to dig around, see what you can find on Sunny Woe, says it's a priority. I read about him. I mean, he reps entertainers, dabbles in porn with allegedly some human trafficking mixed in. Well, why go after him? He's not Sun on Yi. To bring down the Sun on Yi, we have to take down the people who support them, cut off their revenue sources, dismantle the network. This is how we hit him where it hurts. Sunny's revenue stream is massive, and a lot of it flows to Sun on Yi. I'll see what I can do, Raymond. By the way, you hear anything about Dog Eyes? He seems to have disappeared. Haven't heard a thing. Oh, before I forget, Jackie Ma, we're taking him in. Jackie? From what I read in your reports, he'll be a good source of info, and it won't be hard to make him talk. We'll need you to set him up no, no, for no. us. That, that makes no sense. He's nobody. He's a criminal, Way. You're a cop. I hate to be a broken record, but it sounds like you're getting attached. I'm not getting attached. I'm just... I'm not a fucking idiot, okay? He's part of my cover. He brought me in. He's the one who vouched for me. And now you're so high up, you don't need him. He's outlived his usefulness, so we're bringing him in. I'm taking this up with Pendrew. This came from Pendrew. Taking him in accomplishes nothing, and it makes my job harder. I'm not doing it. You don't have a choice, all right? It's a direct order. Yeah? Direct order? Well, that's an order you can shove directly up your ass, Raymond. We want the Red Bulls, the lieutenants like Winston. Open your eyes, Raymond. I am Winston now. That's what worries me, Way. You're one of them. Great work, man. We got him, Van Fokai. Wait, go on, go on, go on. Come out. What the? What the fuck are you saying? Jackie, Jackie. There's Fokai. How you like that, huh? <laughs> Cocksucker. Don't move. You're under arrest. Where are the others? Just me, boys. Just me. Andrew, you piece of shit. One save, poke guy. Ricky, what's happening? It's the 18K. They're all over the damn place. They're trying to kill Uncle Pope. <sighs> Shit. <laughs> Where the fuck is Uncle Pope? I don't know. Where the fuck is Uncle Pope? He's over there. <laughs> whoa, 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 easy, easy. 18K shut off the power. Uncle Poe is on life support. If we don't get backup power running right away, he won't make it. Okay, look, there's a control station down the hall. I'm on it. I think we're clear. That was close. 
Nice work. No, man. We just got lucky. Where was our backup? Now, who's looking out for us? <sighs> Fuck. No one ever looks out for you in this town. I don't know, man. Feels like the game has changed. Used to be a brotherhood. There was a code. Even amongst rival triads. Now we're killing each other at weddings. Even in a fucking hospital. And for what? Let's get out of here. More cops. Get up, get up. Pull up. Well, well, well. Look who decided to join us. Yeah, it's good to see you. Come on in. <laughs> you sure you don't want to fuck a little before you start? It's no problem at all. I'll just have a swing by your hotel on the way to the studio. <laughs> nah, man, I'm good. So we could do a photo shoot or whatever, and look, I'm sure it'd be fun and all, but that's not why I'm here, dude. Ah, you don't know what you're missing. This baby will fuck you in a way your wife never could. Sonny, this is Wei. Wei, the infamous Sonny Wo. <laughs> that's me, infamous and notorious. Glad you could come by. Ricky's told me all about you. This. It's King. What's good? He's producing Vivian Liu's next big hit. Yeah, it's gonna be hot, man. Way here's the real deal. A bona fide tribe killer from the streets. Cleavers, guns, castrations, whatever you want. <laughs> Way, why don't you take King out on the town and show him around? Yeah, anytime. It's like one big playground, man. Nothing's off limits. You want to pick up some girls, get nasty, done. And with Way, no one will bother you. Nobody fucks with Sun on Yi. Yeah, well, I mean, actually, that sounds all right. If you don't mind showing me around. Yeah, sure. <laughs> I wish I could go with you players, but business calls. All right, cool, man. Yo, it was real nice to meet you, Sonny. Streets, let's do it. Ricky, listen to this. I've been thinking. We need to get her a movie role of some sort. Here we are, man. K-Bar. Go. Thanks, man. I really appreciate it. Really. It's real cool to meet you. We'll see you around. Yeah, for sure. Hopefully first night of many. Well, then. Looks like this is the beginning of a beautiful friendship. <laughs> All right, man. Take care. <laughs> I don't mind you fucking her. It's one of the perks. But she has to understand the consequences if she disappoints me. Are we clear? Of course, Sonny. You're not getting attached, are you? A man of your caliber? You don't need to worry about that. I hope not. Way, come in. Have a drink. You ever fuck some famous pussy, Way? Not yet. Maybe one day. <laughs> it's a trip, man. Let me tell you. You drive by one of those billboards the size of a building, and you tell yourself, I'm going to her place. Bend her over the table and... Mm, and then you do it. There's no other feeling like it. <laughs> okay, uh, speaking of stars, I need to go pick up Vivian. Let Way do it. You and I have more business to discuss. How about it, Way? Think you can handle a smoking hot starlet for the day? Uh, sure, I, you know, as long as Ricky doesn't think I'm moving in on his territory. <laughs> no, of course not. Here, take my car. <laughs> you take good care of my little starlet. Go ahead and fuck her if you want. Just don't damage the goods. Who are you? I'm Wei. Ricky sent me. Didn't he tell you? No, I was expecting Ricky. Everything okay? Everything is not okay. Is it wrong of me to want to see my boyfriend? Why do I have to put up with this? No, Vivi. It's not wrong. And you put up with it because Ricky loves you. But... But what? Since your boyfriend isn't driving, I get to sit in front. <laughs> Why are the bad ones always so good looking? I'm Sandra. What's your name again? It's Way. Ricky talks about him a lot. Oh, all nice things, I'm sure. And you're here to basically do whatever we want? Uh, something like that. What do you have in mind? Hmm. Do you have 
Steady hands at high speeds. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. I mean, I, I can provide references if you like. Uh, are you trying to talk him into one of those street races you always go on about? That's him, that's him. Pull up. Hi, Alex. How are you? Huh. This is your new boyfriend? Not yet. Why? Are you jealous? Of this guy? Hey, so Sandra says you like to race. How about it? Now, if you win, I'll let you take the girls home. Wait. I'm not sure how much that's worth. Okay. We race for the girls and a hundred thousand. Sure, I'll take your money too. You racing with the girls in your car? The extra weight will slow you down, idiot. Think of it as your head start, Alex. Because you're gonna need it. Think of it as your head start. I'll show him. Oh my god, my heart is beating so fast. Hey. <laughs> Steady hands. Gotta give you that. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, get a room, you two. <laughs> oh, shit! The police! <clears throat> that was fun, Way. <laughs> Thanks. Anytime. Vivi. Give Wei my number and tell him he can take me out on a second date. <laughs> Sandra says you can take her on a second date if you want. <laughs> yeah, I got that. Thanks. Thanks for taking us out today. It was my pleasure. Ah, Wei. Funying, funying, funying. Kind of you to join me. Care for some tea? Like, like, yum di ta. Thank you. Tu Jin Sao seems to be getting very comfortable in his new position as temporary chairman. Too comfortable. I hear that he is already planning to make it permanent, should Uncle Po not recover. A big smiley will kill him before he'll let that happen. Indeed. And that would allow Li to take over the Sun On Yi himself. But that can't happen. No, it cannot. Tu Jin must go. Dan Hai, he must not be removed by force. He must step down on his own, after which there will be an election. Why would he step down? Tu Jin likes heroin. So far, he has managed to control his habit. Dan Hai, anyone who indulges as he does, lives permanently on the brink of an abyss. Nah, I've arranged for the quality of his supply to improve. And now, you will give him a nudge. Over the edge. Okay. How? He is an immensely superstitious man. Ho Mai Sunga, obsessed with feng shui. He cannot bear to have the slightest thing out of place for fear of the misfortune it will bring. And you want me to make sure his luck turns bad. Very bad. <laughs> I like your style. I will. Those cards must have been rigged. I never had a game like that before. Never! Why, why didn't you stop me? It's your job to protect me, isn't it? Fucking rodents. All of you. What is this? Look at this. How can you let this happen? It's all gone to shit. Gone to shit. What do you want us to do, boss? Get out. 
Get out! I need to think! Chalaya! Way! How'd the date with Vivian go? You wanna be her new boyfriend? <laughs> Relax, Ricky. I'm just making a joke. So, Way, you know Fifi Meow? Uh, you mean the movie star? Yeah, I heard of her. What's she doing these days? She's doing another movie in the Stripper Assassin franchise, but I want the role for Vivian. That's a great idea. That would be huge for Vivian. Yeah, it would help her profile. Aren't you going with Vivian to the release party? Yeah, you're right. Good call. We're releasing the track that King produced tonight. You have a great time. You and the hottest star in Hong Kong. Go, have fun. You know Big Smile Lee? Oh yeah, we've crossed paths. Good. We've got a joint venture making porn. He brings the girls, I bring the production and distribution. That's good money, I bet. Yeah, if Vivian pisses me off, that's where she'll end up. But if there's more money if I keep her a star, I just have to make sure she doesn't flake out on me. I want you to put some cameras up in an apartment. I need it done right away. Can you organize that for me? Yeah, of course, Sonny. I'll take care of it for you. Okay. Here's the address. There's a box of stuff over by the elevator. You look beyond beautiful tonight. Every time I looked at you, all I could think was, <laughs> I can't believe she's real. Oh, Ricky. She's too perfect to be real. Seriously. Every woman wanted to be you, and every guy wanted to. <laughs> well, you know. Oh, Ricky, you have such a one-track mind. Shit. Fuck me, son. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> You know I like that. Okay, <laughs> but let me go freshen up first. Whatever you want, baby. I'm gonna go have a smoke. Andrew, there you are. Are you fucking crazy? What the hell were you thinking of wrestling Jackie, huh? Oh, I thought we were past all that. I just wanted to congratulate you on that business with Tang. Good riddance. Now, what about Sonny Woe? Anything new there? What about Jackie, huh? Fuck, Penju! Are you deaf? No, Officer Shane, I'm not. But you clearly have forgotten who you're speaking to. Way. Forget about Jackie a moment. Whatever we can get to stick to Sunny Woe will obviously hurt Big Smile Lee. And we both want that. Fine. Sunny had me put up a hidden camera in Vivian Lou's bedroom. She and Ricky nearly caught me. He always did have a reputation for that sort of thing. Think you could get a copy of that? Are you fucking kidding me? She's got nothing to do with this shit. This could be the piece that we're missing on Sonny. Can you get it? All right. But I want Jackie in return. Cut him loose. Very well. Get me the video and he walks. I'll get it. All right, I have to go. Get me that video as soon as you can. All right, Penju, I hope you're happy. Vivian? What are you doing here? Well, Sonny says you've been really helpful to him and to me. And I just wanted to thank you. Vivian, no. <sighs> wait, wait. What's this about? N nothing, I just... I just can't. God, Sonny's gonna kill me. Wait, Sonny sent you here? Yeah, don't you know that... Know what? I, I just... I can't do it anymore. Sonny will just... Sonny will just have to get another girl. Look, Vivian, you don't need to. Not with me, okay? So... You mean you're okay with it? <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Wow, you're... You're the first guy who's ever... I mean... Thanks, Way. Way, did you bring the video? And Jackie? Done. This should be all I need to put Sonny Woe away for a long time. And with Uncle Poe dead... Wait, how'd you hear about that? The good news travels fast. I'll have Raymond arrange your debriefing. Congratulations, Way. What are you saying? I'm saying it's over. 
You've done your job. It's time to come in. It's not over. Not yet. Wei, the Sun on Yi is seriously crippled. Your mission was an unbelievable success. I must admit, I thought you'd be happy. Big Smiley will take over. It'll be even worse than it was under Poe. I can't come in now. I'm not finished yet. I understand your personal reasons for doing this, your history with the Sun on Yi. This is why I selected you. But you've done more than enough. Those are my orders. Fuck your orders and fuck you too, Penju. I came on to take down the Sun on Yi, not to shuffle the deck. Shen, you're making a mistake. Wei, the Sun on Yi is seriously crippled. Big smile you will take over. It'll be even worse than it was under the Shen, you're making a mistake. Fuck your orders. Fuck you too, Penju. Joking? Of course I'm gonna pick you up. You're my boy. You okay, Jackie? They treat you all right in there? Yeah, I'm okay. I got lucky. Someone convinced Ming's brother to say it was alone. Was that you? <laughs> nah. I wish I thought of it, though. Some lady cop wanted me to turn snitch. Tang something or another. I told her she could go fuck herself. <laughs> Smooth. You heard about Uncle Poe, though, right? Yeah. When's the funeral? Soon. We should go get ready. What the fuck are the 18K doing here? They're here to make a show. Or maybe to start a fight. All the Sun On Yi leaders are here in one place. I don't think they expected the police to be here, though. <laughs> Never been happy to see the cops before. Hey, where the fuck is Sunny? Sunny Wo? I've been looking forward to this moment for a long time. Yes, and it will make you look so good to your bosses. They might even pat you on the head like an obedient dog. Right up until the time that I walk. Again. Not this time, Sonny. Come on. Don't get your fancy shoes all muddy. Let's go, boys. We got what we came for. We're leaving. Hey, you! You can't do this here. It's a fucking funeral. Goddamn police! Why don't you show some fucking respect, huh? Why don't you? The 18K are about to do this city a great public service. And anyone who stays here deserves everything they get. The cops are leaving? What the fuck? The 18K are going this to... gonna get bloody. Come on. Shit, here they come, man. Show these motherfuckers what it means to be sent on ye! We can't let this go on. We have to deal with the 18K and with the police. Uh, we need a plan. Where's Tu Chin? He's in seclusion. Seclusion? He's in a hotel somewhere, riding the white tiger, that fat fuck! Perhaps you are right, Brother Lee. With Uncle Po gone, we now need a chairman who can lead us through this. Finally, you're making some sense, Chuck. I am the strongest. I am the most feared. I say I should be chairman. Perhaps temporarily. We should go Wait. with... Wait! We need to have a proper election. That is the way it has always been done. It's the sun on you code. Ha! You, a woman, talking of code. You should never have been allowed to be sun on you. But I was. And my contribution to this organization have been significant. With respect, I have to agree with Sister J. We need to restore stability and order. And that means clear thinking. We should follow our tradition. Our tradition? You've only been on Sun Onyi for a short time. What do you know about our tradition? Nevertheless, Sister Jang and Brother Shen are correct. Fine. We'll have the fucking election. But I'm warning you here and now, making anyone other than me the chairman will be disastrous for Sun Onyi. Everyone has a vote. 
Our tradition allows... Who's the tradition? Ricky! No. Goddamn police! Why don't you show some fucking respect? Why don't you? And anyone who stays here deserves everything they get. Concern you. Kill him. Dump him in the harbor when you're done. Do you think it's over? Not yet. They have some weapons in the trunk. You better take them. Thanks. You better lay low. Shen, I got a message for him from Big Smile Lee. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Just the piece of shit I'm looking for. You're going to vote for Lee, you hear me? You don't, we're gonna fuck you. All your ancestors and <laughs> ancestors! Hey, Ricky. Easy. Look, look. We have to talk. I got nothing to say to you. Calm down, okay? Listen, Big Smiley's coming after anyone who's a threat. I work for Sonny Woe. We're Lee's biggest backers, and unlike you, I'm loyal to my friends. Sonny told me about you and Vivian. What? Ricky, I didn't do anything. I swear it. But... Sonny recorded a video of us together to blackmail me, and now the police have it. They're threatening to release it if I don't testify against Sonny. What do you think Lee will do to her when he hears? You said no? Of all the people Sonny told me to be with, Wei is the only one who said no. The only one! Even you, you didn't say no. Listen, Ricky, you have to choose. If you back Sonny, Lee will probably ask you to kill her yourself. Or you can get her out of here, keep her safe, and Sonny stays in jail. Okay, okay, okay but what about Big Smile Lee? You let me worry about Lee. You got a lot of nerve after that shit Pendrew pulled at the funeral. What, he sent you to finish the job? Pedro doesn't know I'm here, all right? I'm completely violating protocol. Look, I never wanted you for this job because of what Dog Eyes did to your sister and how you handle things in San Francisco. But you've done better than anyone could have expected. I can only imagine the pressure you must have been under. <laughs> Don't get sappy on me now, Raymond. Wait, you crossed Pendrew, right? He's cut you off. And this is your last chance to come in clean. What? But what's he gonna do, arrest me? Call me a road cop? Look, I need you to be straight with me. Is he gonna blow my cover? Look, I don't know what he'll do. Not anymore. Wait, just come back with me now. You're a good man. We can fix this. Smooth it over with Pendry. Jackie, not now. I'm busy. Look, it's Jackie. I need to go. Wait. Wait! Where's Jackie? You're as dumb as you look! Stop! Stop! Where's Jackie? I don't know! I don't know what they did with him! What do you mean you don't know? I was just supposed to kill you. I don't know anything about the other guy. Ugh. Who does? D.Y. Agent K's head enforcer. How do I get to him? I don't know. I only talked to him by phone. You tell me, and I might let you live, you stupid fucker. I only talked to him on my phone. Here, take it! <laughs> Jackie! Jackie, <laughs> shit! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck, man. You lied. You know what I'm I'm fucking great. Fuck, 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 Are you okay? Fuck. Oh, man. Calm down. Ah. 
I'm right here, brother. I was gonna fucking die down there, man. Fuck! I thought I was gonna die like an animal, man. Fucking like a dog or something. Come on, brother. You okay? I got your back. Fuck! Fuck! Duh. What do you want to do now, Jackie? The election's tomorrow. We'll want to check out the building, make sure that Big Smile Lee isn't planning any surprises. But we got some time to kill. I don't know. I almost bought it today, man. For real. I think I'm just gonna go take a walk or something. Got some shit to think about. Sure, man. It's cool. I'll see you tomorrow or something. All right. Don't do anything stupid. Jackie! Jackie! The fuck? Oh, fuck! Oh, my God! Jackie! Ah, oh, fuck! Jackie! Ah! <laughs> My name is Mr. Tom. Perhaps you heard of me? Fuck you! I'm no cop! Your friend Jackie didn't think so. He was most loyal. But then, I expect you wouldn't have told him anything. You must be a very dangerous man, Wei Shen. Son of a bitch, I'll kill you. Oh, save your energy, Mr. Shen. You'll need it. The last cup I had in this chair lasted almost 48 hours. Would you like to try for a new record? I understand your personal reasons for doing this. Your history with the Sun on Yi. You do what must be done. There were rumors. Before I'm done with you, you will confirm them. And then you will die. <laughs> That's what worries me, Way. You're one of them. That's the attitude that makes us strong. Loyalty, discretion. Zhang will be disgraced, and Big Smiley will be elected head of the Song Hong Yi. Call me when he comes around. There's no rush. I suppose I should be impressed. You defeating my men like that. I am not. Now. 
Where were we? Sorry, Jackie. Fuck. Lee. Fuck the election. You did this, Lee. And I'm coming for you. Motherfucker. Uh, Mr. Hong Sado! Huh? Don't be stupid! Kill you! Surprise! <laughs> Shit! Time to die, Lee. Huh? Fuck you! <laughs> You're fucked, Wei. You need a long haul. You're done! <laughs> Piece of fucking shit. Fuck! <clears throat> How does it feel, pig? To know that your boss sold you out. And you fucked your way. Almost as bad as you fucked Jackie. You were supposed to die with Winston. Dog eyes blew that, and that poke guy tongue, huh? fucking worthless London. But that's okay, because I am gonna enjoy killing you myself. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Easy their way. This man is in my custody. Yes, sir. You okay? Uh, yeah. <clears throat> Where's Pendrew? He's up for promotion. Interpol. He's done with us. He's dirty, Raymond. He outed me to Big Smile Lee. Take it from me, Way. Whatever you heard, it won't matter. The only voice they hear is Pendrew's. You did what you came here to do. All right? Let's get you cleaned up. Jay? The fuck? Uncle Paul? Pendrel? What the hell? Superintendent Pendrew, I'm surprised to see you. 
You're the one who chased my boys away? Poe, you know why I'm here. I can imagine all sorts of reasons. Uh, I'm sure you will tell me. I'm moving on to greener pastures, but not without taking care of some unfinished business with you and Sonny first. We had a deal, did we not, Pendril? I gave you the three tigers. It made your career. And I let you and Sonny continue operating. A sacrifice you were willing to make at the time. I'm putting Sonny away, and with you gone, I'll finish this once and for all. The only difference between you and me is... Uh, I know what I am. Jesus Christ. Pendrel, I've got you, you son of a bitch. What would you like me to say? Whatever I did, I made Hong Kong a better place. I served the greater good. But you, you let them get to you. You abandoned your duty, officer, and became one of them. You deserve to be handed over to Big Smile Lee. Did I? <clears throat> well, Pendrew, I guess everyone gets what he deserves, including you. You ready for life in prison? What? Because all your old buddies are gonna be waiting for you. I made sure they found out what you did to Uncle Poe. That's a fucking death sentence. I know. Where you can't. I won't last a day in there. That's the plan. Inspector. Officer? I just wanted to say thanks. For what? It's me who should for be... For helping me close cases. Do something I could feel good about. Hell, for helping me stay sane. My pleasure. So, what are you gonna do now? I don't know. I mean, job's over, but... I don't really have anywhere else to go. <laughs> Strange to say it after all that's happened, but... Hong Kong kind of feels like home. Yeah. But which Hong Kong, officer? Hey, what about Wei Shen? He proved himself to be loyal to me. One way or the other. And isn't that what really matters? Leave him be. Yes, Anjay. Drive. <laughs> 